Hey, what's up YouTube and TikTok? So I've been using this trick in my C programming for the past 10 years or so, but it basically lets me uh, never have to worry about writing loops like ever again. And I just wanted to create this video and share. Uh, we're gonna create a macro here. It's gonna be called fast loop start count. And we're gonna assign an int. And then the count is gonna be count. And then we're gonna do four, which is the type, and then I equals zero. And then I is less than the count. And then I plus plus. And then we're gonna finish that off with a left curly brace. And I don't know why it's adding that, okay. So that's gonna be the fast loop start part of it. And then we're gonna do a define, which is fast loop end. And that's gonna be the right curling bracket. And this is how you use the code. Um, it's a C macro and I've been using it in production for years and it's so cool. Watch this. Fast loop start. Let's see if I want to iterate through something 10 times, right? So I do fast loop start 10 and then I do print F my epic loop. And then I do like this. Well, and then I print out the I. You can actually use the inner local variables from the macro directly in your code. It's really cool. Uh, fast loop end and then we run this and watch boom it's so cool so now we just you never have to write loops again it's all right here uh, this trick is awesome uh, I just wanted to share with you guys uh, there's no it's totally bug freaks uh, you can put any type of expressions you want uh, in the parentheses right here if you're getting the amount of um, uh, if you're doing like complex math equations or any type of stuff, um, you can fit everything right here and it's just cool. So uh, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day.